Hello everybody, it's Hannah and welcome back to my channel. So as you can see, you are looking at my extremely, extremely crazy, messy desk and you're probably wondering why am I seeing this? I feel like nobody should ever see this, it should never grace the internet, but that is because I'm doing a desk remodel today. Not a complete desk remodel, just kind of a desk organization video. I ordered a ton of stuff from Timu, which I'm going to insert the little haul right after this clip. The stuff actually has not come yet, but I wanted to clear off everything first. That way I have kind of less of a crazy mess to clean up once the actual stuff comes for me to put things away. I have a ton of like empties, things that just don't belong on here that need to be moved and put away in other drawers and stuff like that. So I figured we will start off the video with doing a little bit of a cleanup just because this is actually like insane. Like it is really, really crazy that I even let it get to this point. So I'm very excited for some more desk organization stuff and I really just need to put this stuff away. So let's go ahead and get started. Um, first thing first, we have some like empties that are just sitting here, which I think I might just need to move these into a box until I film my empties video because I don't, I don't need to be keeping these on top of my desk for like literally for weeks. So I have this like little Garnier thing, Dove deodorants, you know, actually I'm not going to show it all because you're not going to see it in the empties video, but basically I have all this stuff, which is all empties, which let me move to the side and I'm gonna put those in a box that way I can continue to do my empties because my drawer with the little organizer bin for my empties has filled up which is crazy because I have not filmed one in so long but let me move this I have some little acne patches that don't belong out here they belong in my skincare drawer I have some jewelry here which I do keep on my desk but I'm just gonna move this off to the side for now I have this, which actually can go with my lashes, which, yeah, you can see me over there. Um, these belong not on here. This is, like, body care, which I don't usually keep on my desk. So I have, like, this little thing here from Tree Hut. It's, like, this birthday cake thing. It smells so good. Oh, it smells amazing. I really like that. Um, I have, like, a little Chris Morning Air Bath & Body Works fragrance. This Tanologist Daily Glow Gradual Tan. All of this can go in a different section of my room where all my other body care goes. This is just like a cute little bag. I'm just gonna toss that for now. I have another empty. This facial spray I'm not using at the moment. I'm not self tanning right now so that can go in my other drawer. This is garbage. Oh I have some hair products. This is actually an empty um so I'll move that to the empties and then I bought a new one of the color wow so that can go in my hair care drawer. I have my little handheld mirrors. This one broke, but I am going to keep them together. I guess I don't need both halves, so I'm going to put one half just in like a different section of my drawer. And then this one is a lighted mirror, which is good to have sometimes cuz yeah, I don't know. But it's pretty cool. So, I'm going to keep those I guess out on the desk somewhere else. Um, I have this, it's actually empty. I was pouring, keeping this because the bottle broke so like it doesn't open and it would just come right off. So I was pouring that into this Fenty bottle, but I officially have used this up. So move that into empties. I keep my setting spray and everything on here. Nail stuff, I can actually move out of here. I don't know why I was ever keeping nail stuff in here. I have another empty. I have this which can actually go with my other puffs so I don't need that. This is like extra. I guess I'll throw it in here for now. Um, I have like band-aids for some reason which can go. These belong like in the bathroom. These just don't even belong in my room. I have all of this nail stuff which needs to go. I have this I think is empty. Yeah that is extremely dried up so I can get rid of that. This can go back into my skincare. I don't even know if I'm going to keep this little thing. Um, we'll have to see. Perfumes I keep somewhere else, so I don't need to store those here. Again, another perfume. Little Grande Lash is empty. Then I do have some eyeliners. I also have a makeup spatula. So I guess I'll keep that in here for now, just because I don't really have anywhere else to put it. Um, this is actually to dust off like nail dust, so I'm going to keep that there. And then I have a little hand sanitizer. I actually have a different spot to put these. And then I have this little hula brush, which I don't need. And I just dropped it, so it's now under my bed. But yeah, I don't need that, so I'm going to move that somewhere else. And then I have somewhere else where I actually keep um, stuff like this. So I'm going to move my hand sanitizer into that drawer. 
and I'm gonna go ahead and put my nail stuff away in my nail drawer and I'll be back once that's done. All right, so now moving over a slight bit, I have my mirror here, which I'm just gonna turn up so I don't accidentally like get in the mirror, but I have a bunch of this stuff. So again, like I just don't really have anywhere to put this, but I always keep my micellar water here, like my deodorant, my sunscreens, um, primers, and my setting spray because I don't really have anywhere else to put it. I do have this little belief one which can go away. I'm not using this one right now since my um, super goop expires before it so I'm going to put my belief one back into my skincare drawer. I also have let's see um, a new falscara. So this one is pretty dried up. I've been using it but it's been kind of like not that enjoyable of an experience so I'm gonna go ahead and put this into my empties and then I'm just gonna open up this new one and put it with my um, lash stuff and then i also have another one that was empty and i'm gonna put the new one away i have just like some more skincare type things i have this body butter from truly which is so old i think i'm just gonna go ahead and get rid of it i feel like if i smell it it's gonna smell bad oh my god yeah okay that smells terrible and you can see it's all cracked so this unfortunately went off i used up like pretty good amount of it but yeah that is expired so i'm going to toss this and then i have this little cream thing that i got off of amazon that i put like some cerave moisturizer in um to mix in with like my bronzing drops and stuff like that kind of like a drunk elephant dupe um i don't use it all that often but i don't have anywhere to put it because it does not fit in my skincare drawer at the moment so i guess we will have to figure that out same thing with this beekman milk foam calming bubble mask i don't really have anywhere to put that i think i need to do another skincare declutter because i have so much stuff in there that i don't use and like i don't really plan on using it so yeah we will just leave that like that for now i have a couple other random things i have literally one acne patch on here so we'll put that back in my drawer and then i'm just gonna throw away um these are the ones these are like my favorite ones these ones from rael but i'm just gonna throw away that empty package i have a little eevee pin which i don't need to keep on my desk i'll just put it up top with all my other little knickknack type of things um then i have this perfume sample i think it says le vie spell from lancome but i hate the samples that do this like where it's literally just a mini bottle and you kind of have to like dab it out i do like this perfume but again i have a whole little perfume organization section so i don't need to keep that on top of my desk this is rubbing alcohol for my nails so i'm gonna put that in my nail drawer and i have these two like beauty blender or beauty sponge holders this is a real beauty blender uh, and i think this is one oh yeah this is one from luxie i don't really use sponges oh my gosh okay i lost the other one i think it again went under my bed wherever that hula one went so i'm gonna have to find it but these are really old and i'm just gonna go ahead and toss them and then yeah i have all these like extra sponge holders that i don't really know what to do do with them i'm gonna see maybe if my mom wants one because i don't really use sponges all that often anymore i usually just use my brushes so i think i'm just gonna put these on the side and i don't know find somebody else who wants them let me move some of this stuff um i do have some of my skincare over here like this is like the skincare that i usually use most often i also have an eyeshadow palette this is the Alyssa edwards one i needed to do some color for something um but i can put that away i also don't know if i'm going to keep this um organizer here afterward um once all my other stuff comes but i don't really have anywhere else but my eyeshadow palette so it's possible i also had these off camera some more acne patches and then more nail drill bits so i'm going to put the, dr the drill bits away and then i'm also i think i might have to just open this pack up because Oh yeah, it already was open, but I think I'm just going to take out the packs in them because I can't fit this whole box in my skincare drawer. Well, if you guys saw it right now, it's like overflowing. I have this little jewelry box, which is very dusty. Let me wipe that off. And this is super cute. I got this off of Amazon. It has like a spot to put all your earrings, bracelets, rings. Um, I have like hoop earrings and stuff in here, but oh, I don't know why that got crazy. Um, and then you also can like lift it down and then you have necklaces and stuff in it which it's really cute i again don't have anywhere to put this but i might have somewhere to put it once my organizers come so this will have to stay on here for now 
Then moving on to skincare, I have my Merit Great Skin, the recipe Plum Plump. This is actually um, an empty, so I'm going to put that with the empty. And I just have this whole other bin with a ton of skincare in it where I'm just going to leave it for now. So all of that stuff is going to stay, I think, um, all this skincare that I usually use. I don't know. We'll just leave it like this for now until um, the rest of the stuff comes. I'll have more skincare, which I'll put away. I have this nail polish remover, which can be put into my nail drawer. And then I just have like more skincare. Like I don't even use this. I'm going to see if my mom wants this or my brother. He's been getting into skincare recently. So I'm going to see if he wants this because I just have too much and I'm never going to get to this. So I'm going to just put that away. Another random thing I have is this Dermalogica Daily Super Foliant. I bought this as a backup, um, but I just haven't gotten to open this up yet. So I don't know. I don't have anywhere to put it. I'm like so stressed with just like how much stuff I have. I don't know. It's tough. Um, I have my Dyson over there, my Dyson Airwrap, which does have to stay on my desk just because I have really nowhere else to put it. Um, I have more jewelry. The reason why I have this jewelry box is because that's just like my little jewelry box. And then this is the one that usually I wear more often. I usually have more rings in here, but they're in my wallet because I, I, I took them off and I never got to put them back. I have this little brush, brow brush thing, which I don't really need like up here. Maybe I'll just put that somewhere else. Um, I have some clips that go in there. And yeah, that's kind of it at the moment. That's really the best we could do. It does definitely look a lot better. Um, although now I have a ton of stuff on my bed that I need to figure out where to put it, like all those empties. Um, but yeah, I guess I will be back once all of these stuff from Timu comes. We can finally start doing like the remodel. Um, yeah, so I will see you guys then. All right, you guys. So it's quite a bit later in the day. It's nighttime now, but my Timu package came and look how big this is it's like gigantic it's also kind of thick as well but I got a mixture of stuff like I got I think I got some clothes some little random like household type of products and then I also got the desk organization stuff which based on the size of this it looks like I definitely am gonna have to build it um but since it's like 10 o'clock I'm probably gonna do that all tomorrow but I did want to open the package and go through everything so let me go ahead cut this open and I will show you everything that I picked up from Timu again this is not sponsored um I know that a lot of people are doing sponsored videos with them right now but I've genuinely just been curious to order from them and see what the type of stuff they have they have a really huge selection the app i feel like looks kind of scammy but i mean my package did show up so we'll see how the quality of the items are um but yeah i'm super excited so let's go ahead and get into it also while i'm cutting this open i figured i would talk about it but i did place two orders because it was like if you placed one then they would give you like a coupon bundle for your next couple of orders so i placed two orders but they did ship them like together in one package which was pretty cool um because i know sometimes if you order i've never ordered from them before but if you order stuff from like websites like wish and stuff like that they send them all individually but it's really cool because all of this stuff comes together in one package so I just thought I'd mention that because that's like a positive that I really like um, especially having it all come even if it's multiple orders that were done in like the same day a couple hours apart they do still ship together which is pretty nice all right so I guess we will go ahead and start off with the clothing items so if you guys are interested in any of this stuff that I ordered you can go ahead and just let me know and then I'll try and like link it down below if it's still available but let's see what this is oh I think this is like a little like jumpsuit type of thing but yeah so it's gonna be hard to show but I ordered this like I'll pop up a picture on here um it's kind of like this little overall jumpsuit thing um so I got that everything was super cheap I feel like the clothes were especially really cheap then I got a little pack of socks which are very cute. It comes with all of these. They're kind of like these nude tones. So this is the first pair that comes in this set. Then we have these ones and they actually feel really nice and thick and pretty good quality. Then that, then we have these. And then lastly, we have these. So very cute again, pretty cheap. I think I got all of these for maybe like $3, something like that. So that was the next item that I got. Oh yeah, this one I'm actually very excited for. It's just like one of those cute little sweaters that you can wear, like tie over like a little tank top or something like that. And it just has the little tie in the front and then these really cute 
kind of like butterfly sleeves. So this is very cute and definitely going to be cute for the summertime. Then I guess this is not clothes, but I ordered more of these like hair crocodile clips. So it was pretty good. Comes with five of them. And I think this might have been my last clothing item. This was just a very cute little knitted kind of crop tank top, which I think is so cute. I really love the detail on this. It's very, very adorable. So that was the last clothing item. Now let's move on to more of the random stuff. Next thing I got was a car like phone holder. It's not like a charging one or anything like that. It does just like go into your vent and hold your phone, which is so cute. It has like these little gummy bears and you can extend it based on if you want to hold your phone sideways and it just kind of like shapes into your phone. You can also, I think, just set it on here as well in the vent clip, but it has like these little pink kind of gummy bear looking things very very cute so i also got that then i got this as like one of my other little desk organization things i had to put a command strip on this but basically it just like goes on the edge of your table and you can put like your hot tools and stuff in there like obviously when you're not using it because it's plastic but it just is goes on the side of your desk to kind of extend it a bit and to hold a little bit more storage for stuff then i got this plate which i thought was actually pretty cute it has um it's just a plate it actually comes with two of them and then they have little holders for dips so if you're having like fries like a burger and fries and you can put like ketchup in it or like wings and ranch or you know blue cheese whatever i just thought it was really cute and i feel like my mom would really like these i'm excited to show these to her then like i think i mentioned before i just got a couple more of these makeup little puffs Ooh, this next thing is going to prove to be very helpful um i did get a little cute box cutter it's like a heart but I actually don't really have like a box cutter thing like this so I'm excited to have it it's gonna be definitely very helpful to have in my room while I'm opening the rest of these packages then I got this set of nails which I thought was really really cute um, they look kind of big so I really hope that they go small enough for my nails because I have very very tiny nails and these are like gigantic it would even be like too big way too big for my thumb so i will have to see those i'll test them out maybe in a different video then i also ordered this bracelet which is really cute it's just like a super simple silver one but i don't really have very many bracelets and i kind of wanted to get into them a little bit more because i just feel like they look nice like they look very dainty and cute so i picked up this plain silver one then i also picked up a pair of rings it comes with two of them i ordered them in a size nine which normally i wear like a size eight or seven and a half or eight just depending on the finger but i did want these oh yes it does fit okay because on my for some reason some of my fingers are like much bigger than my other ones this one's still kind of a tight squeeze but they do fit pretty well and they're very cute i mostly just wanted it for this one but it did come with this other little one here but i just feel like those are really pretty and definitely very cute and they do fit pretty well i would say they run probably a little bit small um, I'd say they fit more like an 8 rather than a 9, but that's why I did size up because I figured they're probably not going to be super true to size. And it's hard to find rings that fit my hands. I feel like I have such wide knuckles. Like size 9? That's crazy, but whatever. Then this next thing is actually kind of cool. It's a thing to like help you put on bracelets. Like some of them can be pretty difficult to put on by yourself. And I just wanted to try this out. I saw it and I was like, gotta get that. I think it's like you grab this is like a weird bracelet because it's not a clasp for, for some reason it just has these little like parts that you just slip it into um so it's kind of confusing i need to play around with this a little bit more because i can't get it right now but it is cool and in theory i feel like it would work so again we'll test this maybe in a different video or i'll just keep practicing with it okay this next thing is kind of random i'll pop up a picture in here again it's a thing to make uncrustables and they had like a circle one and then they also have the square one but i feel like the square one would waste less bread like it would just cut off the edges um instead of like cutting off a bunch of like the corners of the bread so i picked this up which is kind of random but i thought it was fun um so yeah i got that then i also got another pair of nails which these ones look a little bit smaller again hopefully they do have some smaller sizes but i thought that these were really really cute um very dainty and delicate then i also have this oh, i got a headphone stand because i have beats but i usually just keep them like folded up on my nightstand but i really wanted to get this holder so let me open this up all right so very basic but i mean it should work let me go and get my headphones so i went ahead and got my headphones i think they just sit on there like that yeah so pretty good this is just simple but it is what i was looking for um it also has like a little lip over here on the bottom so you can put like jewelry and stuff like that um like sometimes i know i always forget to like take my rings off before i get into bed and it does look pretty cool so 
yeah i'm actually very happy with that this is going to be loud the packaging so let me open this up and roll it out and then i'll show you what it is this is actually pretty cool it's sort of like a faux leather so this basically will just go over the desk to protect it and i've really been wanting one that was a little bit bigger than the one that i currently have which is actually just like a placemat from ikea but this is a really nice sort of like faux leather type of one just to put over the rest of the desk and i feel like it'll give it a nice sort of chic look so yeah it's definitely a little bit bigger than i thought but i do like it so got that and let me go ahead and use my new box cutter and i'm gonna open this next item up this item is actually a little cosmetic cotton box holder so it can hold like cotton pads q-tips just basically anything that you want to put in here it has a little lid which is nice so it won't get dusty um so i got the white one i had them in a couple different colors but i think the other thing that i got was in white so i wanted them to match and then it has really cute little rose gold feet but yeah this is pretty cool and i'm definitely happy with this one because my current situation is a little bit crazy so yeah i'm definitely excited to set this one up on my new little desk organization section oh before i move on to the final thing i also picked up another ring it says that I got this one in a size 7, which I don't think I did, so I'm going to have to check my order on that. Um, but basically, I got a little ring with a Z on it because my boyfriend's name is Zach, but it does fit on my ring fingers, which is perfect. But I just thought that was super cute and can't wait to show him that. Um, I've been wanting something that had a Z on it for a while and I just haven't done it. So yeah, I'm excited that I finally got that. Then I thought I ordered two of these, but maybe I didn't. Um, these are just like a shelf, so I'm not going to open it up yet just because it's not put together, so it's not going to really look like anything. But tomorrow I'm probably just going to go ahead and put this together and then start doing the organizing and stuff like that. So yeah, I will see you guys tomorrow. All right, you guys, so it's a little bit later the next day, but I did go ahead and actually put together the little shelf. As you can see, it was super easy. I'll put in a little overlay right here, but you just snapped them together and then screwed it in. Um, it wasn't difficult at all. It was like, I think maybe seven screws total but i really love it i also put together not put together set up this thing so i have some of the cotton pads and then i put my contacts in here and then just a couple of little cotton swabs just to have those sitting on my desk i have all of like my, my rings my lash stuff little tools things like that i have all my skincare my makeup brushes and then things that i use like every day no matter what uh, which is like my little cleanser, deodorant, uh, SPF, and then of course my lip balm. I have my little mirror down here, which you can see, and then of course my Dyson, and this, which I don't remember if I showed it or not, but I did go ahead and adhere this onto here, so I have just like my brush and my straightener, not plugged in, but I just, I'm going to keep it in here for now, and then I got all my little clips lined up here, and then this is kind of crazy but on my lamp like neck just because I don't really have anywhere else to put it I have all my headbands which that was there before um, but I figured I would just show the little setup but yeah that is how everything came out sorry if the sound quality is not that good I have my air conditioner going but it is way too hot to turn it off in here but yeah, that is it for my little desk transformation. Um, I really hope you guys enjoyed watching. My consensus is that this is really, really good. Not like, you know, the best quality. I can't really tell what the material is. It's some sort of like wood, I think. But yeah, I do really like it and we'll see how it holds up and withstand the test of time. But for now, I do like it. It gives me a lot more space on my actual desk here, which normally my laptop I keep on my bed but overnight I usually just put it on my desk and I'm getting ready for bed because I have work really early tomorrow um but yeah so I have a lot of nice room on here it doesn't really look like it but I do um but yeah I really am loving everything and the new setup I think it looks at least a little bit more organized now um but yeah that is it guys I really hope you guys enjoyed watching and I will see you in my next video bye <music>